Hello Booktube, uh, today I'm going to be doing the Book Murderer tag. Um, the tag was created uh, pretty much today by uh, Noah at the Bookworm and he also tagged me in the video. Uh, if you don't know Noah's channel, he's, uh, you should go and subscribe, he's great. Though I should give you a bit of a warning, he, uh, he does seem to have an obsession with smut. Now he will blame this on Venn at uh, Venn's Book Corner, but Venn is, as we know, as pure as the dripping snow. And it's merely um, Noah trying to um, avoid uh, recognising the true uh, true fact about his nature. But anyway, we'll, we'll uh, draw a veil over that uh, situation and get on with the questions of the day. So, question one. What are your thoughts on spine breaking? Well, I don't like to do it, but I do feel with paperbacks it's something that's going to inevitably happen. Not so much with, um, and, and to a lesser degree, I think it can happen with hardbacks, but mostly it's something that, it's something that happens with paperbacks. And so I try not to do it, and I feel that people should try not to do it, but at some point it may well happen. So it's, it's sort of hoping, it's sort of prepared, trying not to do it, but being prepared that it may happen at some point, even if you don't attempt it to. Question number two. Bookmarks or dog earing pages? Um, generally, I use bookmarks and I have done for quite a while, but I used to when I was younger, when I was at school, uh, um, dog ear pages, mainly because I didn't have bookmarks. But that, I, sort of, I, I sort of stopped doing that when I was about um, 12, about 12, and I started using uh, makeshift bookmarks, usually um, uh, receipts. From things I've actually bought at, uh, at bookshops, so water cells and that. And now I actually have a set of uh, a couple of um, I've got bookmarks. One of which I got from something I bought of Amazon. Another one is, um, in fact, I can show you them. One of which is this I got given from Ollie from Criminal Ollie for Gab August uh, a couple of years ago. And the other one is in my copy of Heart of Darkness. This is this. Which I got in a, um, let's say from, uh, I think it was, it was e either eBay or Amazon. It was included in with the book as sort of thank you for buying the book. So, so that's what I use for my bookmarks. And that's what I use bookmarks. Page three, oh, sorry, chapter three. Oh, I don't know what I'm saying there. <laughs> sorry about that. Question three Page tearing or ripping? If you do this, you are a barbarian and you should. Be ashamed of yourself. There is no need to tear or rip a page of a book. Full stop. No question in my mind. Unless it is obviously an accident, which which of course can happen. But if it is unintentionally, I am I am always horrified at that fact. If anybody does intentionally, it's just no. Question number four: Writing in books. Right, before I give my full answer, I'm just going to pre prefix, uh, sort of preface this with a statement that when I, what I'm about to say does not include somebody writing in the front of a book uh, sort of as a present saying this is to somebody or an author not signing it or uh, somebody just, as I usually get this when you're a kid where you'll get a book and you'll just say it's my name's Joe Bloggs, 14, owns his, owns his book. So that sort of thing is fine. That's not what I'm talking about. When it comes to writing in books, in the under writing under uh, text or writing in a margin or anything, no. As a kid, I was taught you never write in books, with those with that obvious exception that I gave at the beginning, and people who do are savages. You just don't do it. No, no. Uh, question number five. Ripping covers and book binding. Who rips off book covers or binding? Who? No, I, that, I, I've never known anybody to do that. But if you do that, you are you are a heretic. You deserve to be burnt at the stake. That is the act of uh, that's a an act of a complete heathen. No, uh, unacceptable. Straight to prison, straight to the in front of the firing squads, no blindfold. 
and five times it, yeah. And uh, question six, which is the um, uh, who do you tag? Well, I'll tag Sean De Sanfast, Gavin from Genre Books, uh, and uh, at Nigel from Reading Ideas, and also Jenny uh, Parks, uh, though in her case purely to add on the pressure. So with that, Booktube, I'll say goodbye, and I'll see you soon.